We are looking for anything. We went past Bibblezook Dam, but sadly there was not even a bird there. Ooh, I see eyes. I think we could have lots of bush babies. Yes, we do. I'm just going to find that. You see that reflection, don't you? There's two pairs of eyes in that quarry tree. There they are. There's one. It's got a baby in its mouth. Does it? Yeah. Oh, look at that. That is mom carrying around her little ones. Look at that. I've never seen this before. I've only ever read about it. So she's obviously moving them. That was amazing. And I think I actually saw where the nest is. There she is. You can just see the reflection, the tapetum flash. That is amazing how she carries them too, almost by the scruff of the neck. Well, not quite the scruff, more on the back. Come on, where are you going to go to next? Oh, we've lost them in the thicket. But I think, Brian, I actually saw where they were nesting. Let me go forward because I can see a reflection here. Do you see? Let me find a gap. But do you see where I'm talking about them? That there's, I think there's a hole. You see there? There we go. Yes, you see there's that hole right in the tree. There's a little head popping out. There's another little one. And I'm, I'm pretty certain that that is a youngster that is in the hole there waiting for mom to come back and move it. That's amazing, Brian. Have you ever seen that before? No, Wonderful. Pulling out all the stops this afternoon. I don't even know what you call a baby bush baby. Bush baby lit. What do you think, Brian? Bush baby eeny, bush babette is another one. Perhaps you can give us a helping hand over here. If you know what a little bush baby is called, please let us know. Hashtag Safari Live. It'll be quite interesting. Please use the big World Wide Web to help if you don't know yourself. It'll be nice. We can all learn here. I'm trying to keep my spotlight as still as I can. This is so exciting. Now, I don't know where she's going. And I don't know why she's moving them now, because that looks like a good little hole, unless there's perhaps a build-up of parasites, or maybe there's been a predator that's been lurking around that's encouraging her to move her youngsters. As you can see, it's quite curious. It looks like it wants to come out. And probably in the same way that lions and leopards tell their little ones to stay behind, I'm sure that it has received a similar instruction from its mother. That was honestly one of the most amazing things I've ever seen. Hi, little guy. That is really, really spectacular. Now, I'm dying to see where mom has gone. Because I'm looking for other trees that could potentially house them. Let me have a quick scan. Maybe we pick up on them again. She obviously can't move very, very quickly. Youngster, let's have a look. There they are. Well, there she is. Okay, kitty kitty bang bang, you said that a baby bush baby is an infant. That makes sense. That's pretty easy. I thought that we're going to be a bit more creative. It would have been nice to have had a different type of a name for a bush baby, but infant it is. Thank you very much for your handy help there, kitty kitty bang bang. Now the patience game comes. Now it's obviously very exciting to sit and watch lions sleep and then obviously the patients waiting for them to wake up. But I am itching in my seat. I cannot wait for mom to come back. And I'm also quite curious, Brian, I think I can see them right in front of us. So I want to quickly aim these lights so we get more. There's mom. So mom's not coming back. It's got the baby again. No ways. That is incredible. Look at that. And it's such a clear shot too. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Hey, Brian, how amazing is this? Now she's got a good tree, but she's let go now. You can see it's actually not too accustomed to climbing around just yet. Maybe there's a hole in this dead tree. It'll be a good spot, but I think she is slightly panicked. Come on, girl, take her, take her where you need to take her. Wow! And how amazing it is that, that she's able to jump those lengths while holding her infant. I think that that must be, that's an incredible talent. I mean, can you imagine holding a baby as a human and trying to do long jump? Never. Or high jump. 
You would never be able to be safe and keep your little one in out of harm's way. Oh, wow, that was amazing. That is really, really cool. That's been one of the coolest things I think I've ever seen. Like I said, I've only ever read about it. You can see just the leaves rustling slightly. So she's, she's sitting back there somewhere. She's moving around. 